Yo, yo, boys and girls, it is your boy Diversity here, back with another video for the channel. I hope you're all having a great day, wherever you are, wherever you're watching this video from. I hope you're having a smash day, wherever you are, people. Do you know what? I'm going to take this one this week. It is match day. Football is here, the best time of the week. Southend in cup action today versus Darlington. Let's get into today's video. But before we can get too far into today's match vlog, make sure you're subscribed to the channel and got those notifications on. We are so close to 1,400 subs. It is unreal how close we are, guys. A few more and we would have hit the target that I set to get by February. Come on, I know you've all got it in you. But Southend versus Darlington today, the Quakers coming to Roots Hall for cup action. What a game this is. Southend have not played Darlington in a long time. We've played before, but a lot has happened to both clubs, actually. Since then, Darlington have gone bust and come back. Southend have been on the verge of going bust multiple times in that, time, in that year span. But do you know what? Both clubs still here today for a big match. Darlington, top of the National League North. That is some right in their own. Their joint top, I believe it's with Brackley off the top of my head. They have got some big games coming up after this cup game. Their last five, they've won three, lost two, and they are coming off of a 3-0 loss versus Chorley. It is a big game today. Whilst they sit top of the National League North, they have had a bit of shaky form as of late. Blues coming back into their stride after a few losses in December, winning 3-0 against Solihull last weekend, and a draw at Bromley puts Blues in a firmly positive spot. I reckon we see the same 11 today as we did versus Solihull, but will Hobson get a start? That is the question. We have not seen Sean Hobson play in a few weeks now. I think it's his time to return. We need the king back on the field. I'm going to get down the roots hall now. Let's get into today's action. Come on, you blue boys. Stay obviously, Blues is a stern test. Let's get into today. So, FA Trophy 4 Crowns. Pitch to the goal ahead at 1.45. So let's hear it for Darlington and Southend United. That's not bad. Confusing calls are offside. Goals given. This might get rolled out. The goal stands. Oh, the goal stands. Oh, the goal stands. Let's go now, more! <laughs> Yeah, 
Ladies and gentlemen, I thought the push was in the country in the of two minutes. Right then, all half time at the Hoyer. Found myself a nice comfy chair to sit on down here. It worked last time, being in the bar against Bourne in the cup. We're going to go for it again, surely. This is a good luck charm, but 1 1 at half time. The Holland have been good. Honestly, Blues have been winning the battles, doing it all on the pitch, which is good. A few iffy moments with goalkeeper kicking, a few mystery passes, but the pitch is not great condition. They cancelled the half-time entertainment show where you've got to hit the crossbar, whatever it is nowadays. I never really see it. They comes out due to the pitch. It does look like you're playing on wet cardboard out there. It's hard, it's boggy, especially down the side that I'm sat on towards the east end. It is very muddy, so there's little action down this side, but it's been okay. Blues have had moments. Darlington have had moments. It's really anyone's game at this point. Anyone could take it to any length of this game. I'm hoping the second half we just have that little bit more quality to nick it. We've had good chances. Darlington great on the counter. It really could go either way in this game. Stick around. Ooh. In the meantime, the Darlo player has been stretched off. And now the one who's been up the fans has gone down. <laughs> this guy, Joker. Oh. Oh, well Oh, 
That's over with. Oh, I'm going home. I didn't sleep after I need a year's worth of sleep. I get it. Right then, oh, back at the car now. It is cold. It's only got cold since I arrived earlier, but get in there, boys. Round five. Here we come. That was amazing. Well, in fact, I'm not going to say it was amazing. It was absolutely, it scared the living poop out of me, if I'm honest. I'm sure all of us in that stadium thought he was going to penalties. Darlington, I'm going to start off with you like, fair play. You know what? There were spells in the game you were on top for a great period. Your fans are the loyalty. Just the amount of support you gave that team out there. Yes, there were times where you were under the cosh. You were still loud and proud of them. That's probably the most away fans we've seen at Roots all this season. Maybe bar maybe Wrexham or Notts County. It was amazing to watch you in full voice. And fair credit for you being top of the National League North. I'm sure we'll see you next season maybe if we're in here or not. But Round five of weights, get in there. That's a bit of cash in the piggy bank. Ron Martin, you know, that court date's coming up. That should help you out a smidge or two. Happy with the performance. Cardwell, two goals, brilliant. I don't know what to say. I've got a banging headache after that match. My head is all over the place. I'm going to go home and edit this video. So thank you to everyone who came up to me today. Said your nice words. I hope you all enjoyed this video and make sure you're tuning in for next time's game. My name's been Diversity. If you've enjoyed, make sure you like, share, comment, all that good stuff. Peace.